Many people love tofu. There is this tough tofu in Chinese called bei tofu, and also this soft tofu called nan tofu. Besides all, all those kinds of tofu, we also have lots of tofu byproducts. For example, dried bean curds, and I will call this dry tofu. And these are the skin for making tofu. And this in Chinese is called fu zhu. And you also have these kind of tofu skin, which is like a sheet. It's also in English called dried bean curd. But it's totally different, and uh, these two usually used in totally different kind of dishes. So today in my video, I will use these fuzhu to make a, a pork belly, and it's cooked in a clay pot. To get a pot of cold water, and we were adding one tablespoon of Chinese cooking wine. Couple slices of ginger, two slices of pork belly, about 250 to 300 gram, and turn our heat down high and cook it until it starts boiling. Now our pork belly start boiling. We can turn off our heat and rinse it under warm water. Now we have our pork belly cleaned. And we can cut them to thin slices. For this recipe, I will use some dried bean curd. In Chinese, it's called fu zhu. Pretty much means tofu bamboo because they look like bamboo shape, really long. So add a bit of vegetable oil. And usually you will need to soak this in the water overnight. But here we are just going to stir fry this because we're going to use a clay pot to cook our pork belly with these for uh, a bit longer times, so 30 minutes or so. So we take about 100 grain of dried bean curd, then we kind of break this to smaller pieces. Now we can turn our heat on medium low. So by stir frying our dried bean curd could give our bean curd a bit flavor as well as helping it um, containing the shape while cooking later. Now we can stir fry our pork belly using the same pot. Just put everything in. So medium low heat. Once our pork belly turns golden brown color, we can turn our heat off. Here is our clay pot. We're going to put in our dried bean curd first. Adding our stir fried pork belly. Two to three cloves of garlic. One tablespoon of Chinese cooking wine. One tablespoon of light soy sauce. Half tablespoon of dark soy sauce, a pinch of salt, a pinch of sugar. Now adding enough water to cover our pork belly. And putting this on our stove on high heat until it starts boiling and turn it to medium low heat and keep cooking for about 30 minutes. So after 30 minutes, you can see our dry tofu actually become a lot bigger and soft. Now we can open our lid and let it cook to reduce the sauce. This takes about 10 to 15 minutes. So here is my pork belly cooked with my dried bean curd or you call it dried tofu. Let's give it a try. You can see the sauce is reduced and our bean curd is really chewy but soft. Mm. I like the chewy, a tiny bit of crunchy texture. Mm. And it's soaked in the soy sauce. Here our pork belly. 
Mm. There's texture from the bean curd and the pork belly. It's really harmony together. And I put a little bit of spring onion in there just to decorate it as well. So, hope you like this video. Please give me a thumb up and leave your comments below. If you want to see more videos like this one, please subscribe to my YouTube channel. And thanks for watching.